The evening was a huge success. We want to thank everyone who came out to watch the games. The overall winners were the seniors taking first place in the football game and the cheerleading competition. On Wednesday, the National Honor Society sponsored the Mustang Reality Showdown. All the classes are committed for their hard work to prepare skits and get real playing minute to minute, extreme faculty makeover, and fear factor. The seniors had the best skit and the overall winners of the reality showdown were the sophomores. Our annual rodeo games were held in the gym yesterday. This fundraiser is, to, is held to support our Mitchell Scholarship Program and it was well attended by our students. The events included relays, an egg toss, musical chairs, over and under competition, and the traditional tug of war. The seniors placed first in overall score and the juniors won the tug of war. The spirit banner, a traditional competition, required each class to present a banner that tied in the homecoming theme and class spirit. The seniors received first place for the banner and juniors came in second. Finally, to get ready for tonight's game, our homecoming pep rally was held at the end of the school day in the gym. It was a totally awesome 80s blacklight event and our students should be proud of their display of school spirit, enthusiasm, and cooperation. For spirit at the pep rally, the seniors came in first and walked away with the spirit stick. Also at the pep rally today, it was announced that Umberto Yushi as the SRP of the year and Christina Pertilla as the teacher of the year. We would like to thank student council for coordinating all homecoming activities this week and we couldn't have done it without the dedication of the class advisors who somehow managed to pull their classes together and get things done. The senior advisors are Stephanie Bombi and Michelle Chamberlain. The junior advisors, Danielle Desiante and Vicki Bisak. Sophomore advisors, Andrea Barry Guth and Katie Mooney. And freshman advisors, Michelle Herring and Tanya Waterman. This event could not be, pos could not be possible without the leadership and guidance from the one and only Ed Braddy, who is the advisor for the student council. Finally, we would like to thank our staff and administration, led by Mr. Jim Michaels, for supporting and participating in our homecoming week activities. Are you ready for the homecoming court? Up first, representing the freshman, class of 2019, Haley in a 1966 Ford Mustang, driven by Dave Henson from the Mustang Club of Tampa Bay. Haley in a 1998 Chevy Corvette, driven by Jim and Vicki Dillon. Brittany in a 2006 Ford Mustang, driven by Jake Devitt. Ashley in a 2007 Ford Mustang from Steve Shutt Auto Sales. Representing the sophomores, class of 2018. Demi in a 2006 Ford Mustang, driven by the Cinemaldi family. Sierra in a 2008 Ford Mustang, driven by Eddie Bewley and the Hasselberg Girls. Bree in a 2015 Ford Mustang from Carl Flammer Ford. Tabby in a 2013 Ford Mustang, driven by the Scala family. Representing the juniors, class of 2017, Brianna in a 2015 Ford Mustang from Carl Flammer Ford. Mariah in a 2008 Chevy Corvette, driven by Freddie Jones. Denitrium in the 1966 Ford Mustang, driven by Dave Henson. And Bianca in the 2012 BMW 335 IS, driven by the Risco family. And for the seniors, the class of 2016, bringing them around on some of these fabulous Mustangs we saw earlier. Thank you to all of our drivers this evening. Francesca Colilli in the 2006 Mustang. Princess Pezza in the 2007 Mustang. Allie Chamberlain in the 2006 Mustang. Rihanna Acevedo in the 2008 Mustang. Kenzie Bennett in the 2015 Mustang. Zoe White in the 2014 Mustang. And in another 2015 Mustang, please welcome back last year's homecoming queen, Mallory Eline.
before we introduce our homecoming court, we would like to recognize our Mustang Band and ROTC units for participating on the field. And as a reminder, the band will be performing its halftime show in its entirety at the conclusion of the football game tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to meet your 2015 homecoming court. The, two, the students on the homecoming court are selected by their classmates. Representing the freshmen, class of 2019, Haley Lewis and Austin Fields. Kaylee Bredemeyer and Lee Francisco. Brittany Mathis and Henry Futch. Ashley Armstrong and Marco Kalili. Representing the sophomores, class of 2018, Demi Asensio and Austin James. Sierra Cantini and Jordan Garcia. Bree Chamberlain and Brian Horsberg. Tabby Gatowski and Levi Bowler. Representing the juniors, class of 2019, Brianna Armenia and Nicholas Schmidt. Mariah Guy and Baraj Patel. Dimitri Arreo and Larry Dalabetta. Bianca Richko and Jordan Winchell. One more big round of applause to all of our underclassmen. And now representing the seniors, the class of 2016. First up, Francesca and Dominic. Francesca Kalili is the daughter of Rob and Kathy Kalili. Francesca is a varsity cheerleader, the class of 2016 student council secretary, a member of the HOSA club and the Interact club. Francesca plans on attending the University of Central Florida to pursue her nursing degree and become a neonatal nurse. Dominic Umar is the son of Carmine and Linda and the nephew of James and Michelle. Dominic is a varsity football player, a member, member of the social inclusion club, and on the Special Olympics Unified Sports Team. Dominic plans on attending the university to study environmental engineering. Princess and Kevin. Princess Petza is the daughter of David Will and Arlen Petza Will. Arlene, excuse me. Princess is the president of the class of 2016 and the president of the GSA Club. She is a member of the HOSA Club, the Medical Academy, and the Spanish National Honor Society. She is a varsity swimmer and basketball player. Princess would like to attend Florida State University to major in pre-med and become a surgeon. Kevin Smith is the son of Kelly and Mary Beth Smith. Kevin is the captain of the Mitchell Swim Team and was named MVP his sophomore and junior years. Kevin would like to attend a university and eventually become an air traffic controller. Allie and Kyle. Allie Chamberlain is the daughter of Doug and Michelle Chamberlain. Allie is a four-year varsity cheerleader, one of the captains this season, and a two-time SAC All-Conference cheerleader. She is, she is the vice president of the senior class and a member of the National Honor Society. Allie would like to attend Auburn University or the University of Florida to stu pr study pre-law and eventually become a lawyer. Kyle Schroeder is the son of Sean and Carrie Schroeder. Kyle is a member of the Mustang, Mustang Band and saxophone section leader. He is a member of the National Honor Society and the Math Honor Society. Connor would like to attend Berkeley College of Music or USC to study jazz and audio engineering. And Kyle will be playing this weekend at the Clearwater Jazz Festival. <laughs> Brianna and Evan. Brianna Acevedo is the daughter of Carlos and Trudy Acevedo. Brianna is a member of the Mustang Band and is currently one of the drum majors. She is the treasurer of the National Honor Society, the vice president of the National, Honor, Hon National Art Honor Society, and a member of the National Thespian Honor Society. Brianna would like to attend Florida State University to major in child psychology and minor in American Sign Language. Evan Gaynor is the son of Morgan and Mary Beth Gaynor. Evan has been a member of the Marching Mustang Band for the past four years playing flute and tuba. He is the Sergeant at Arms for the Social Studies National Honor Society and is a Wrangler. Evan plans to attend college next fall. 
Mackenzie and Jorge. No, I don't. Mackenzie Bennett is the daughter of Christian and Shelby Bennett. Mackenzie is a four-year varsity golfer, a senior class student council representative, vice president of the Interact Club, a member of the Medical Academy, as well as the Science, English, and Math National Honor Society. Mackenzie plans to attend the University of South Florida to major in biomedical science and eventually become a physician's assistant. Jorge Figueroa is the son of Jorge and Nancy Figueroa. Jorge is the president of the youth group at his parish, involved with team court, is a wrangler, member of the art club, and is actively involved in the Good Samaritan project. He plans to attend the University of South Florida to pursue a degree, a degree in biochemistry. Zoe and Ty. Zoe White is the daughter of Tom and Candy White. Zoe is the executive secretary of the student council, the secretary of the National Honor Society and a varsity athlete on the cross country and track teams. Zoe would like to travel after she graduates and plans on pursuing a biomedical engineering or genetics degree at the University of Florida. Ty Weatherill is the son of Doug and Donna Weatherill. Ty is commanding officer of the NJROTC, president of the National Honor Society, and president of Interact. He is a member of Mu Alpha Theta and an athlete on the varsity track team. Ty would like to attend the University of Florida to pursue a degree in biomedical engineering and eventually become a physician or engineer in the United States Navy. Let's all give these incredible students a big round of applause. And joining us on the field tonight are last year's homecoming king and queen, Nick Bowler and Mallory Eline. Nick is currently attending the University of South Florida and pursuing a degree in international business. Mallory is attending the University of Mississippi and is a cheerleader for the Rebels and pursuing a degree in special education. And now, here are the winners of this year's homecoming court. The 2015 homecoming prince is Evan Gaynor. And the 2015 homecoming princess is Brianna Acevedo. And now your 2015 homecoming king and queen. This year's homecoming king is Dominic Fumara. Ladies and gentlemen, Mitchell High School 2015 homecoming queen is Francesca Covilli. Congratulations to everybody on the Mitchell homecoming court this year. Don't forget tomorrow's homecoming finale, the dance in the gym from 7 to 11. I hope to see everybody there.